Hi everyone, it's Anthony back with another video and tonight we are going to be doing an unboxing. Um, depending on when this gets uploaded or when you see this, um, it might be after the holidays or kind of after that, that holiday period, but this is um, actually something I'm putting together on Christmas Eve. So um, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays to everyone. I uh, spent the day with family, got to hang out with my mom and brothers, aunts and uncles, cousins, all of that good stuff. Um, opening presents, sang a little karaoke, had some fun, um, but I'm back home. We're gonna rest up and then ideally tomorrow I'm gonna get some skiing done because there was quite a bit of snow that um, hit the mountains here in Colorado um, all day during um, Christmas Eve and going into tomorrow there's supposed to be even more. So really looking forward to that. But anyway, I got home after spending time with family and there was a box sitting at the door and this was a box I was very very looking forward to or really really looking forward to cracking open and I figured why not do a nice unboxing. So this is going to be from the brand Soft Services. It doesn't have the um, any marketing or any branding on the box itself. Um, Soft Services is a relatively new body care company. Um, they're based out of New York and I kind of stumbled upon the brand on my uh, Instagram feed. It just kind of popped up. I feel like Instagram does such a good job with these like targeted ads that like pop up on my feed. I get introduced to a lot of brands that I'm not familiar with through those <laughs> those ads and the majority of them I don't end up really falling for because they usually gear a lot of natural skincare brands towards me which isn't really you know my style anymore like specifically that like super clean natural uh, skincare and body care um, brands and products. They do also some targeted like men specific brands, which also just really isn't me from a marketing standpoint. So I'll usually click on the ad, look through their products, look at the ingredients list. And for those natural and clean products, it's almost always a whole ton of essential oils. It's basically just like, especially the cleansing oils. I love when they send me and a brand that um, sells cleansing oils that don't have any emulsifiers. It's literally just a bunch of fragrant oils and maybe some sunflower and jojoba thrown in there. So you have to use like a hot cloth to get them off. So anytime I see those, I kind of skip right past them, don't even worry about them. But this Soft Services is a body care product or body care line that was developed specifically towards treating um, KP, excess keratin, um, you know, in the follicles, um, ingrown hairs, acne, hyperpigmentation, but on the body. So this is something that I've always dealt with and something I've always, uh, you know, been struggling with ever since, you know, I started getting acne on my face and body hair and stuff, so teens essentially. And while I have found some products that work fairly well, I haven't really found a line that is like the complete picture and really tackles a lot of those things that are on your body the same way that you would on your face but maybe in a more impactful or more concentrated way because that skin can be a little bit more rough and a little bit harder to make those changes on the body than they do on your face where those skin cells are turning over a little bit faster and there's more targeted products so trying to find something that really had that similar impact of just repairing hyperpigmentation dark spots tackling acne, battling ingrown hairs but on the body, I haven't really found anything that was like that complete picture. But Soft Services seems to have pretty much everything covered as far as I can see. Um, I've got their entire collection. I went ahead and picked up the, the color, I think the everything kit, so it's one of everything. And um, yeah, let's dive. This is quite the, this is quite the box. All right. I also have my computer here too, just to look up some additional details, including pricing. Um, this kit, I believe, all together was 176 USD for the entire kit, um, and that is a discount when you buy them as a bundle. But we'll go over each individual price of the product, so you have that as well. Um, so it comes in this really, really cool. I think they call it their forever bag. So this is a really neat. I think it's a paper bag, but it might be wax coated or something like that so it's water resistant. Oh, it has a little bit of a fabric feel. And it's actually stitched as well. Um, it's got the soft services name. And from what I understand, we'll have to crack this open, 
but it is lined as well. And the intention is this is something that you can reuse over and over. So you can take this to the grocery store, use it as a really cute tote. Um, I even saw that somehow they tied the laces to make it kind of an over the shoulder messenger bag. So I'm excited to play with this, um, but let's go ahead and open this up. Uh. This is such cute packaging. I really, really love this. So um, one of the co-founders of this brand has a podcast, Eyewitness Beauty, I believe it's called. And she, along with someone else, founded this brand. The other co-host of Eyewitness Beauty, I believe, is a co-founder of Necessaire, which is another one of my really favorite body care uh, products and lines. They have the body serum it's a kind of a hyaluronic acid uh, moisturizing and hydrating serum that i like their body lotion is really nice it's a little on the thick side um, but i really like it and then they also have a body wash that i really love even the fragrance free and the scented versions and then they have a body exfoliator which is kind of a chemical slash physical exfoliating wash and we'll get to why i think this is going to be a little bit better for me once we get to that product so Let's go ahead and unravel this. Oh, yes, yes, yes. So it's like a, it's got like a fabric lining on the inside. This is so cool. This is such a fun bag and all the products are there inside. Let's go ahead and start with the soft services buffing bar. So I'm going to, I think I'm just going to do a grab bag. I was going to try to do them in order, but we'll just grab and go. So this is the soft services buffing bar. Such interesting packaging. So cool. So this is a set of two physical exfoliating um, body soap bars. So this has that physical physical exfoliation in it. It has some like uh, what they call sanding crystals. You also have some moisturizing and soothing qualities here as well. So um, you've got your coconut based surfactants in here. So I'm not exactly sure what the pH is here. I'll have to double check to see what the pH of this cleanser is. Um, you've got glycerin in here, shea butter, then you've got your alumina, and then your magnesium oxide. Those are your two exfoliating um, kind of granules here. You've also got some um, aloe leaf juice in here as well, and that's really it. It's just about the cleanse, a little bit of aloe for that hydration, and then some buffing. So they say that this is perfect for removing that excess keratin. Those, uh, those of us that suffer from that kind of KP, chicken skin, scaly skin, some flakiness, or if you have really rough, dry elbows and knees, this is kind of geared for that. So you have two bars. I believe this retails for $28 uh, for the combo set, so two bars. And let's go ahead and take a look at what those look like. Um, so yeah, soft services, buffing bar. Da, 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 da. Very cool color. Um, it's got the information, the micro crystal exfoliant on the outside of it. Very, very nicely packaged no scent it just has kind of a um just a soapy scent maybe a little bit of that shea butter coming through but not even soapy in the sense that it's like a fragrant soapy it just has kind of a nothing just a, a nothing scent <laughs> a little bit of that shea butter it has kind of almost like a light oil so this is the soft services soap home so this is a ceramic soap holder for either in the shower or on the vanity or on your counter what have you um this is um, this is the blue. I got the blue version. So let's go ahead and see if we can open this up without breaking something. Cool. So it just comes out like a little drawer there. There's two pieces to this. You have the uh, ceramic tray here that the soap gets set on. And then you also have an aluminum cover to it. So you can set it like this to set your soap on top of while you're using it in the shower, that type of thing. But if you are leaving that in the shower and you don't want to get those, the water splashes on it and get the soap all, you know how soap kind of soap bars can get a little bit grimy, which is one of the reasons why I typically don't go for bars of soap. You just flip the aluminum cover over. So then when you are in the shower, if water does get on this, it tends to drip off the side. Um, that way it's not getting going directly on the bar of soap it just kind of runs off which is really cool this one comes in at $36 for the topper and the ceramic tray that just sits on it like such so next up we have the soft services smoothing solution calming gel exfoliant da, 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 da. so this is a 10% lactic 5% urea 
um, really, really nicely spreading gel, according to them, that features at AHA to help dissolve the buildup of dead skin cells and helps to calm redness and irritation. I can also see this fighting against um, those ingrown hairs, that type of thing as well. So a 10% lactic acid treatment, it's got also that urea, glycerin, you've got sodium hyaluronate, aloe leaf juice, panthenol, centella asiatica, um, and some other texturizers and smoothers as well. This is another fragrance-free product. And um, it says basically on clean, dry skin before moisturizer, apply a thin layer on areas of the body that are uneven in texture or color. Uh, best results are with daily use. And you get 150 fluid ounces here, I believe. So quite a decent size for, um, for something that's like a treatment. So that's one of the reasons why I thought that this might be a better option for me than some of these washes that include some of those acids because a lot of times they're in that body wash. So you're just using that body wash in the shower, which means you're incorporating a whole bunch of water and a lot of that's getting rinsed down the drain. Um, a lot of people that I follow, a lot of dermatologists, dermatologists and other kind of skin care and body care gurus will say take those washes apply them on dry or lightly damp skin let them sit for a few minutes and then get into the shower so you're taking that wash and trying to spread it around or you're taking that body scrub and you're trying to spread it around on dry skin not necessarily as it's intended as the product describes and then getting in the shower and I've always found that to be a little bit of a pain I tried that with the necessaire their body exfoliator trying to spread that all over my body on dry skin before I got in the shower and because it's a soap it's trying to like lather and foam but it can't really go anywhere it gets a little sticky a little gloopy and then you're just kind of standing like this for a few minutes and then getting in the shower so I like the idea that this one is after you get out of the shower you're gonna towel off and then apply your um, AHA treatment, which is just what you would do with your face. This is at a pH of 3.7. So there's that. I'm so excited. Like I, this just sounds like exactly what I've been needing for my body. But this is the Soft Services Clearing Clay Multi-Use Breakout Treatment. This is at eight ounces. So that would be 240 milliliters. So a massive size massive size and it's just such unique and interesting packaging every package like there isn't not too much of a brand story like there is a little bit but it, they're all very very unique um so it's not like every one of them's blue with a whatever stripe like they all have kind of a story to tell but they're not intrinsically tied together from a color and even the texture of the even the texture of the boxes is different which is really cool so this is a maximum strength sulfur acne medication. So you have 10% sulfur in here. Um, you also have kaolin, bentonite clays, zinc PCA, glycerin, aloe leaf juice, um, arnica, montana flower extract, salicylic acid, so a little bit of BHA in here, glycolic acid, um, so some AHA, phytic acid, tea tree leaf oil, so this one is scented. You also have some um, sodium hydroxide, um, ethyl hexoglycerin, some texturizers, that type of thing. So this is a clay-based mask that also has some AHAs and uh, BHA in that salicylic acid, and you have um, that sulfur. So this is specifically targeted um, to um, gently exfoliate dead skin cells, be that anti-acne, anti-breakout, anti-discoloration, and soothing clay mask. So this is so this is so cool. This is so up my alley as far as a treat because if I am going to do something like put a mask on my body for acne, then I want it to be like a true mask for the body rather than oh just use this exfoliating cleanser and rub that rub that on your you know legs or on your butt and stuff and then just kind of stand next to the shower this can be used as an in shower treatment so apply to clean body skin prone to breakouts massage for one minute in the shower kind of maybe shower hitting you facing we're at opposite the direction of the water or as a mass treatment before you get into the shower apply a thin layer to a clean dry body um so Here's here's where I might have a thing like I might have take issue. So I think in my head that I would be okay 
disrobing to whatever I'm comfortable with, you know, outside of the shower, before I take a shower, go ahead and put on this mask. Um, I keep like <laughs> rubbing my, I'm, I'm putting my hand on my booty because I do, like that's where I have some issues. So I keep, that's where I keep gesturing. Um, put that clay mask on, lay out on the, like on your bed, you know, uh, you know, lay out on the couch, look at your phone for, uh, according to this, five or 10 minutes, and then do your shower routine. Hop in the shower and then work through with your cleansing bar, whatever else you're going to use. That's how I would do it. Because they say clean, dry, body skin prone to breakouts, that almost makes me think that they're suggesting you take a shower and wash, then get out, dry, put on a mask five to 10 minutes and then come back and maybe wipe it off with a washcloth or hop back in the shower. So I'll have to get some clarification from them on what they actually mean, but I don't see any reason why, unless you're really like physically, you know, have some like physical dirt and debris on your skin that you couldn't just do that. That's besides the point. Leave it on five to 10 minutes if you're using it as a mask treatment and then you're gonna rinse thoroughly. You can also spot treat with this. A thin dab to a pimple, if you have a specific pimple, blemish, ingrown hair, something like that, on your body, apply a thin dab to that, um, that area, allow it to dry for several minutes, or you can leave it on even overnight and then go ahead and rinse that gently. So you have three uses, in shower, as a whole area mask treatment prior, or I guess post shower, and then as an overnight or a spot treatment. Use this three to four times a week or as the breakouts persist and then less often to prevent new breakouts. So this is a targeted treatment and then you can use it as maintenance mode as you see fit. So very, very interesting. 1% zinc PCA, 10% sulfur, glycolic acid, salicylic acid in here as well, kaolin and bentonite clays to help draw out excess oil. If you do have you know, I have ingrown hairs that can get a little gross. This can help to draw some of um, all of, you know, fluid. We're just going to be honest, drawing that to the surface and clearing that out. So very, very excited about this. And I will, I can go on and on <laughs> just with this unboxing, but the size, huge. And let me, let me reverse real quick. Um, let's talk about the pricing for the past two products. I'm going to dip out of frame. We've got... $34 for five ounces of the Smoothing Solution Calming Gel Exfoliant. And then we have $28 for eight ounces of the Clearing Clay. That is a lot of product, very awesome. So, and it's like, you can just, it's got some weight to it too. So I love that they're kind of encouraging some pretty generous and frequent use of these products. They're not skimping out. You're not seeing a, 30 milliliter serum or a 30 milliliter treatment. Okay, so moving on, we have what's called the Korea Cream or Caria Cream. This is their daily toning lotion for body. And you have 11 ounces here. So I think that's 330 milliliters. So massive size for a body product. Just to give you some reference, we have the three products that are in my stash, my body lotions that I've yet to get to. This is the Drunk Elephant TLC Glycolic Body Lotion, 240 milliliters, 10% AHA plus marula esters. So you have that. So um, 90 milliliters less here. Then you have the body lotion from Necessaire. This is their fragrance free, 200 milliliters here. Um, so 130 less. And then we have the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Pink Dream Body Cream, uh, smoothing and moisturizing. This thing, this box has been through it. I need to finally work this into my routine. 240 milliliters here as well. So this one is much larger than those others. So this is a large size. So this is a daily toning lotion. You have urea in here as well, 10% urea. 3% squalane and 1.5% colloidal oatmeal. So this is all about creating a soft, clear and calm skin that's also really, really nicely hydrated and well nourished. So you also have squalane in here, dimethicone to help lock everything in, colloidal oatmeal, panthenol, sodium hyaluronate, uh, propolis extract as well. Um, there's just a lot of really nice nourishing, hydrating and moisture locking ingredients in here. Um, and that squalane is just gonna be excellent for creating kind of a soft, smooth, supple skin feel. So the same with the urea. So let's go ahead and take a look. And once again, just, I don't know if that's gonna focus very well. 
with that. It's just the um, uh, carrot cream or the um, or Korea cream. The logo is kind of hard to see because it's kind of like a tan on white. There we go. But yeah, just very interesting and unique. It's one of those things that's like, ooh, what's that? So, ooh, uh-oh. So this is an aluminum bottle. Mine has just the teensiest bit of dent to it, but I don't think that'll be an issue. But yeah, nice um, aluminum bottle. And we also have our locking pump here. This is a reusable locking pump. So you can, I believe on their website, you can just buy the, cr the cream, no pump. But since this is my first set, I went ahead and got the pump. But yeah, and this is just, it just feels so, um, I guess higher end from like your skincare, um, skincare products because of that aluminum and it's just got so much weight to it, which is awesome. We have the Soft Services Clearing Mist. This is their medicated breakout tonic for body. Da -da 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 -da. Um, so this has 1% salicylic acid and this is supposed to be used as a clearing mist. From what I've heard, this is a um, salicylic acid mist that also has zinc PCA and it's supposed to be used as an antimicrobial, antifungal, anti-acne mist for either out of the shower or on the go. So I've heard this is great for if you've been sweating or if you're at the, you know, if you've been at the gym and, or it's just been a hot day and you've been out walking around or maybe you've been wearing constricting clothing and you do have some chafing or you have some um, excess uh, sweat buildup, those types of things. This mist can help to quickly just kind of refresh everything, kind of help to mitigate and manage any uh, potential issues that might arise from that. So this might be a really good spray for where you have, um, as Dr. Dre always says, skin on skin contact. So any uh, folds, any creases under your arms, between the legs, between the butt cheeks, all of that stuff might be a good area to go ahead and give a quick spray with the clearing mist. One thing that a friend on Instagram who got some of these products sent to them they did mention that the tea tree leaf oil that in, is in here can be a little intense if you get it to, like kind of too close to the face. So I'm curious to see if I am also sensitive to that. Um, I think maybe he was using it on his armpits. I'm not really sure where he was using it, but he just mentioned that it almost kind of made his eyes water. It was kind of almost that menthol-y kind of um, intensity. So I do want to be careful of that. You have aloe leaf juice, niacinamide, zinc PCA, Oh, hi, Maverick. What? <laughs> I'm dog sitting and he just bro What? What? Can I help you? I don't know what that means. What? Okay, are oh, you need attention? Give me just a minute. Go on, get out of here. <laughs> Give me just a second, I love you. Okay. <laughs> I'm dog sitting. Um, I dog sit for my best friend every year. And I've, I've done it every year since he was a puppy. So this is year eight. And so I think this is the first year he's been here while I've been recording and he is not happy. He wants love. Um, okay, so we'll wrap this up. Um, so we have, oh my gosh, now I'm like all flustered. Okay, so we have aloe leaf juice, niacinamide, zinc PCA, that tea tree leaf oil. We also have um, a couple different root and flower extracts, including cal calendula and, and sarsaparilla root extract. Interesting. But we also have alcohol, pretty high on the a second on the ingredients list. And even though I'm not a huge fan of uh, denatured alcohol in my skincare ingredient, skincare products, I don't really mind it. I don't hate it, and I don't actively avoid it. But if it's super high on the ingredients list, that usually tips me off to pay a little bit more attention to how my skin's responding to that product. I'd assume they want it in this product because it helps ingredients to penetrate and kind of dry down a little bit faster, which is probably what you want when you're talking about an on-the-go mist. You know, if I just got done with a workout or if I just got done with a long hike and I'm in that locker room, I'm in that bathroom, I kind of want to just mist it on and kind of, you know, pat it and let it dry quickly so I can get dressed and get out of there. I don't want something that is like a full-on, like, mist that's going to stay super hydrated and saturated. You kind of want the opposite of that. You want things to kind of dry down, get rid of any of that funkiness that might be going on, and you can get out of there. So especially on the armpits, I'm going to probably want that to kind of 
let's go. Come on, you know, so I see why the alcohol is in there. I'm curious to see if it does cause any dryness or irritation on my skin, however. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and crack this open and see what it looks like. They send it to you in just its actual, just plain bottle. This is a pH of four, by the way. And then you also get the uh, reusable fine mister. So that just gets popped on top to give you that fine mist. This looks like from what I saw in the pictures, it might be one of those kind of fog misters that's super duper fine. So you just pop this on and then when you're done, you can go ahead and just purchase the bottle. So I love that these caps and the mechanical and metal pieces are all reusable. Very, very nice. That's that, that is everything from Soft Services. I just wanna call out this like awesome, bag. Once again, it's this kind of fabric lined paper bag that's got this really cool um, drawstring on it. It doesn't, it doesn't look like it cinches though. Um, I think it's just intended to kind of fold and then fold again. So I don't know. They had it as an over the shoulder bag, but I couldn't, um, I couldn't see myself <laughs> walking around like crunch, 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 crunch. So I'd probably just take this to the grocery store or you know what, if I had like takeout or something like that or leftovers, I could pop them in here. I don't know, I'll find some uses for it. Believe you me, it, oh, you know what this would be good for is like farmer's market in the springtime and just bringing this to pop your, um, to pop your veggies and stuff in as you shop. So yes, very, very happy with all of these products on paper. Can't wait to start working them into my routine. I'll probably start working them in tomorrow when I get back from skiing because I will probably even bring the clearing mist with me up there because I cross country ski and I get hot and sweaty and nasty. So um, it'll be cool to see how all of this stuff works together. I'm so excited. Maybe, maybe I have found a body product line that is actually geared towards my skin where I deal with some rough texture, a little bit of flakiness here and there, a little bit of ashiness on the knees and elbows, ingrown hairs, body acne, um, clogged pores. I get these really weird, uh, very apparent blackheads right between my chest here. They almost look like little uh, poppy seeds kind of stuck like right here. I'll get like three of them because that's where there's the hair follicles and stuff. So anyway, I'm just, I'm very excited. I hope you are too. Let me know if you have any questions or want to see a first impressions of any of these products. I will happily slap them on and let you know how they're going. Otherwise, be on the lookout for a full review or a brand review of soft services here in the next couple months as I work these products into my routine. And other than that, let me know if you have any recommendations for really awesome body care or body acne care products that you have been loving. Thank you so much for watching and as always, stay glowing. Bye.